Hey guys, so I just got a new package, so let's open it. Okay, let's open it. Okay, and then we just open this. Okay, so it looks like we got P for pizza. Oh, was that a receipt? Yep, that is a... from Big Potato Games. Nice. Okay, so let me remove, remove this. Okay, so here's the game. It says ages 8 and up, 2 to 4 players, P for pizza, plastic free. The Easy Cheesy Letter Game by Doruk Kichikoglu. I cannot say that. From Big Potato Games, certified B Corporation. So this is a newer version, 2020. Oh, it's not as new as I thought. When did they be have a B Corporation? Or when did they become a B Corporation game? Okay, there's our socials. Here's the back. Color vision deficiency friendly. Spaghetti. And Mamma Mia, think of a word that connects the letter to the category, then shout it out before anyone else. The speediest player wins this slice. Scan to see the game in action. There you go. Okay. Contents 80 cards, one rule sheet, and one sticker. This sticker is made from plants. Okay. Says it twice, I guess. Okay, let's open this. Let's cut open the tape. Comment down below if you think Tilt and Shout is plastic free, since B Corporation, I'm pretty sure, is for plastic free things. It can be for others, but okay, let's open this. So we get our sticker, obviously, right here of them eating pizza. Thin as thin all the time. Or it's, uh, of course, it's thin. And then we got Big Potato Games. And then we've got the instructions. Oh my goodness, this is an interesting storage, but it was what I thought. They were going to put it in like a diamond shape. When I, Before I filmed this video, I was thinking like, how are they going to put it? Then I'm like, oh, they're probably going to do like a diamond shape or something. This is an interesting way to store it. I don't know how you're supposed to put it in there. So this works. Okay, so here's the rules. You can just say how to play P for pizza. Oh, I didn't even know they were going to do that. That's cool. That's cool. They did the same rules, but they did it where instead you make it like this instead of an actual pizza slice. Okay, let's see if... How can I take this off without ruining it? I don't think I can. How am I supposed to take this off? I don't think I can take this off easily. Yeah, it just rips. Darn it. And the other one... Well, it looks like it's gonna have to rip. Unless you want to use it like that. That works too. But yeah, this works too. And then you just slide it back in. I don't think I'm gonna keep those. Okay, so we got some categories on this side. And then we've got some letters on the other. We've got that twice. They definitely saved packaging this time. Once again, you've got it. And tell me if you want me to show you all these cards. I probably won't read them unless we have like some people who are um, can't read well or can't read at all. But there's the cards. So now let me just put this in the instruction back. So I uh, don't think anyone's ever opened the newer version of this game. So I'm going to do you all a favor by, I guess, looking at the bottom. And it looks like there's nothing there. Okay, so then we're going to put these pizza slices back. Oh, they're all numbered. That's nice. I didn't even know they all had numbers. Okay, so let me put this back. Okay, so I'm going to finish putting this back. Just don't really want some background noises in the video, even though I live with my parents because I'm 17. Right now, okay, so let me put the instructions back and the sticker back. Actually, I'm going to show you what I do with this sticker. So I, so I now have a box for these stickers in here. We got a green box, and I put all the stickers in here. 
Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. That was unboxing P for Pizza 2020 edition. See you guys next time. Bye.